shoe. The reinforcing method is applied in cases of deficiency. Fullness should be relieved, and the excessive heat must be dispelled. The reducing method. It also says that heat syndromes should be treated by swift needling. While cold syndromes by retention of needles. If the qi is deficient, marks of bursion should be applied. If it is neither deficient nor excessive, we should select points along the affected meridian. The reducing method is to dispense the deficient factors and remove stagnation in order to help restore systemic immunity and is indicated for excessive syndromes, while the reinforcing method is applied to deficiency syndromes to restore the qi in the body. For excessive heat syndromes, the method of brisk needling or spunking with a three-edge needle to cause bleeding is used to reduce and dispel pathogenic heat. Or marks of Russian is applied to patients with deficiency syndromes, such as strong pathogenic colds or stagnation of zhang fu, meridians, collaterals, and qi, to enhance yang and dispel coldness. When qi and blood stagnate and block the jin mao, the blood letting method is applied to remove the stagnation. Marks of bursture is applied to raise yang qi and to lift prolapsed zhang fu organs. Points of the affected meridian are chosen to regulate qi in blood, for syndromes which only involve particular meridians. For example, Wai Guan, San Jiao 5 can be chosen for migraines. Clinical application of acupuncture must be based on a theory of traditional Chinese medicine with reference to the traditional diagnostic methods. Instead of the eight principles of yin and yang, cold and hot, exterior and interior, and deficiencies and excesses, only then can the principle of treatment be determined. There are three categories of point selection. One, selection of local points. This means choosing points which are near the diseased area. For example, Zheng Wan, Ren 12, and Liang Ren, Stomach 21, can be chosen for epigastric pain. Two, Selection of distal points. This refers to the selection of points from from the diseased area. For example, choosing Zhu San Li, stomach 36, for epigastric pain. Three, selection of symptomatic points. This refers to the selection of corresponding points according to some prominent symptoms. For example, Dan Zong, Ren 17, is selected to treat qi disorders. There are five categories of clinical combination of points. One, selection of points from the diseased meridian. That is to say, points along the diseased meridian to which one of the organs is related will be prescribed. For example, Zheng Fu, Long 1, Qi Zhe, Long 5, and Yu Ji, Long 10 are selected for cough. Two, Selection of externally and internally related points. That is, if a disease occurs in a certain zhang or meridian, points which are externally and internally related are prescribed. For example, Zhu Sanli, stomach 36, and Gong Suan, spleen 4, are selected for epigastric pain. 3. Selection of anteriorly and posteriorly related points. It is also called combining abdomen and vent points or yin and yang point selection. For example, Jian Shu, bladder 14, 
and Danzong Ren Seventeen can be chosen to try to help him. Four. Selection of superior and inferior points of the body. For example, to treat migraine, fracture, gallbladder 20, and xiaxi, gallbladder 43, can be selected. Five. Selection of left and right points. This method is applied to selection of points on both sides or the opposite side to the diseased area. For example, Jiu Yu, Large Intestine 5, Chu Chu, Large Intestine 11, He Gu, Large Intestine 4, on both sides are selected to transform Yi, while Mi Guan, Third Party 6, and Yang Ling Quan, called Letter 34 of the left side, are chosen to treat hemiplegia of the left side. The five shoe points are a simple five name for the five points of the twelve meridians located below the elbow and knee, namely Jing, Well, Yi, Spring, Shu, Stream, Jing, River, and He, Si. The ancient Chinese doctors compared the flow of Qi to that of a river, small and shallow at the beginning, becoming larger and deeper gradually. The points at which qi springs up are called well points. The points where qi flows copiously are called spring points. Points where qi flows like a stream are called stream points. Points where qi flows through are called river points. And where qi gathers are called si points. The theory of the five shu points is derived from clinical practice, and it can be explained by the theory of root and branch. Clinical application of the five shoe points should be in accordance with the characteristics of climate and seasons. In spring and summer, shallow acupuncture on Jing Ying points is applied, while in autumn and winter, deep acupuncture on Jing Ying points is preferred. The five shoe points can also be used according to the indications pertaining to each of them. For example, Jing Yuan points are indicated in the fullness of the stomach, Ying spring points in febrile diseases, Shu stream points in listlessness and painful joints, Jing river points in asthma, cough, and fever, and He Si points in diarrhea and preservation of qi. In addition, the five shu points can be selected according to the respective relationships with zhang fu and the five elements. That is, the method of reinforcing the mother and reducing the son. For example, the excess lung syndrome can be treated by reducing the chizhe lung five points, which pertains to water in the lung meridian. This is called reducing the sun in excess syndrome. In contrast, the deficient lung syndrome can be treated by reinforcing the taiyuan lung nine points, which pertains to earth in the lung meridian. This is called reinforcing the mother in deficiency syndrome. Apart from these, reinforcing and reducing can be applied not only between mother and son points, but also between mother and son meridians. Each zanfu has its corresponding shu point and wu point. Wu points are located in the chest and abdominal region, while shu points are on the back. The shu and wu points, when used in combination, can treat corresponding zanfu disorders. For example, the front wu point zhong wan, ren 12, and the back shu point wei shu, bladder 21. The wu and shu points of the stomach may be selected for stomach ache. The 
Yuan source points treat Zongfu diseases, while the Luo connecting points treat disorders of externally and internally related meridians. The Yuan and Luo points may be used independently or in combination. The first affected meridian is compared to a hose, the second a gas. For example, if the lung meridian is first effective, the yuan point high yuan, long nine is selected. If the large intestine meridian is affected second, the low point pian li, large intestine six, is selected. The eight confluent points are those in the extremities connecting the eight extra meridians. For example, gong suan, spleen four, connects with the chung meridian. And Neguan, pericardium 6, links with the Yin Wei meridian. These two points, when used together, can treat disorders of the stomach, heart, and chest. Influential points may be used to treat the diseases of the corresponding tissues and organs. For example, Danjong Ren 17, the influential point of Qi is applied to the internal heat syndrome, while Zhong Wan Ren 12, the influential point of Fu, is used to treat Fu organs. Cleft points are selected for acute diseases of the affected meridians and Zongfu organs. For example, the C point Kong Zui, Long Six is selected and treated for lung diseases accompanied with hemoptysis. The C point Simen, pericardium 4, may be treated for heart pain. He C points refer to the six He points located below the six Fu organs of the three young meridians of the foot. They can be selected and treated for corresponding Fu diseases. For example, Shang Ju Shi, stomach 37, is for large intestine disorders, and Xia Ju Shi, stomach 39, for small intestine disorders. The crossing points refer to those located at the intersection of two or more meridians. It can be used to treat disorders in the related meridians and Zang Fu organs. For example, San Yin Jiao, spleen 6, is used for treating diseases of the liver, spleen and kidney, and the respective meridians. Stroke, Diagnosis and Treatment Stroke is an emergency case manifested by sudden collapse with loss of consciousness or even coma, often resulting in hemiplegia and aphasia. It is caused mainly by disorders of the heart, liver, spleen, kidney, and also by an invasion of wind, fire, and phlegm. When wind and phlegm attack the meridians, they block the flow of qi and blood, or disturb the mind, and thus result in this disease. Stroke refers to cerebrovascular diseases, such as cerebral hemorrhage, cerebral thrombosis, cerebral embolism in modern medicine. Stroke is divided into two categories. One involves the Zongfu organs, while the other involves only the meridians. The former may manifest itself as coma, etc. In the latter, the patient may be conscious, but suffers from hemiplegia, deviated mouth, dryness of the throat, and slurring of speech. Hemiplegia. The point on the affected side, Jian Yu, large intestine 15, Chu Chu, large intestine 11, Yang Guan, San Jiao 5, He Wu, large intestine 4, Huan Tiao, gallbladder 30, Yan Ning Quan, gallbladder 34, Fang Long, stomach 40, and Xuan Zhang, gallbladder 39, 
may be selected and needled with an even movement method to regulate chi and blood in the meridians. After routine sterilization, puncture Jianyu, large intestine 15. Chi Chi, large intestine 11. Sanjiao 5. Zhen He Gu Xie. And He Gu, large intestine 4. These points can regulate Qi, blood, and the meridians. Needle the Huan Tiao, gallbladder 30 point, until the sensation reaches the foot. And now puncture Yang Ling Quan, gallbladder 34. Puncture Feng Long, stomach forty. And finally, puncture Xuan Zhong, gallbladder thirty nine. These points have the function of removing obstructions from the meridians and promoting the smooth circulation of blood. To strengthen the effect, the electric needle is applied with a continuous wave at low frequency for 30 minutes. Scalp acupuncture may also be applied. Puncture subcutaneously along the anterior oblique line of vertes temporal on the side opposite to the affected one. The electric needle is applied once a day with continuous wave at high frequency for 30 to 60 minutes. The patient is encouraged to exercise his affected limbs. For slowing of speech or aphasia, the points Yaman, Du 15, Lian Quan, Yan 23, Tong Li, Heart 5, and Feng Long, Stomach 40, can be needled with an even movement method to remove the obstruction and promote the circulation in the meridians. After routine sterilization, puncture Yaman, do 15. Do not puncture too deeply. This will help restore the function of speech. Puncture Lian Quan, Ren 23 to restore the function of the tongue.
puncture Tongli, part 5, to regulate the meridian. And puncture Fenglong, stomach 40, to dispel phlegm. The treatment is given once a day, or once every other day. One course consists of 12 sessions. For patients with difficulty in swallowing, the plants Lianxuan, Ren 23, Tiantu, Ren 22, Danzhong, Ren 17, Neiguan, Pericardium 6, and Zhaohai, Kidney 6, can be selected and needled with an even movement method to regulate qi in the meridians and restore the swallowing function. After routine sterilization, Lianquan, Ren 23, is punctured to regulate the flow of qi and restore the function of speech. Puncture Tian Tu Ren 22 to regulate Qi and restore the function of the tongue. Zhong Ren 17 point is punctured to regulate the flow of qi and to suppress the pathogenic factors. The Neiguan Pericardium 6 point is punctured to relieve the chest. The Zhao Hai Kidney 6 point is punctured to nourish the kidney yin. The treatment should be given once a day or once every other day. One course consists of 12 sessions. Diseases of the Zhangfu organs can lead to loss of consciousness. If it's an excess syndrome, Shui Guo, Du 26, the 12 Jingwei points, Tai Chong, Liver 3, and Feng Long, Stomach 40, are all needled with a twirling and reducing method to expel wind, eliminate phlegm, and promote resuscitation. Puncture Shui Guo, Du 26, to revive the patient. the 12 Jing well points to remove any obstruction. Puncture Feng Long, stomach 40, to resolve phlegm. And Tai Chong, liver 3, to pacify the liver and expel the wind. In case of deficiency syndrome, indirect moxibustion with salt is applied on Shen Xue, Ren 8, with a large moxicon. Indirect moxibustion with ginger is applied on Guan Yuan, Ren 4, with a big moxicon to restore Yang from the collapse. Dizziness.
Dizziness is mostly seen in hypertension, arteriosclerosis, anemia, and auditory vertigo. Deficiency of qi in blood is generally caused by overthinking and overworking, which leads to damage to the spleen and deficiency of qi in blood. Thus, the brain is poorly nourished and dizziness occurs. Dizziness is accompanied by paleness and a lusterless complexion, palpitation, weakness, and insomnia. The diagnosis is pallidness of the tongue, with a thin white coating and a thready weak pulse. The points Bai Hui do 20, Qi Hai Ren 6, Zhu San Li stomach 36, San Ying Jiao spleen 6, and Pen Shu bladder 20 are needled with a twirling and reducing method in combination with mild moxibustion to nourish the spleen and stomach and to replenish qi and blood. After routine sterilization, puncture Bai Hui do 20 to make qi ascend. Puncture qi hai, ren 6, to strengthen the primary qi. Puncture zhu san li, stomach 6, with the reinforcing method. San Yin Jiao Spleen 6 with a reinforcing method to invigorate the spleen and stomach to produce qi and blood. Apply Mario Marks of Bustion on points Qi Hai Ren 6 and Zhu San Li Stomach 36 to strengthen the effect. Puncture Pi Shu Bladder 20 to nourish the spleen, qi, and blood. activity of the liver yang is generally caused by overthinking, anxiety, depression, or anger. The main manifestations are dizziness with a distending sensation in the head, a flushed face, red eyes, and irritability. The tongue is yellow-coated, is string taut, and there is a rapid pulse. Treatment points Feng Shu, Gallbladder 20, Gan Shu, Bladder 18, Shen Shu, Bladder 23, Tai Xi, Kidney 3, and Xing Jian, Liver 2 are needled to nourish Yin and pacify Yang. After routine sterilization, Puncture Feng Shu, Gallbladder 20, with the twirling and reducing method to reduce Yang. Puncture Gan Shu Bladder 18 with a twirling and reinforcing method. Puncture Shen Shu Bladder 23 with a twirling and reinforcing method to nourish liver yin and kidney yin. Zhen Tai Xi, 
Puncture Tai Xi Kidney 3 with the twinning and reinforcing method to nourish kidney yin. And puncture Xing Jian liver 2 with the twinning and reducing method to pacify the liver yang. Interior retention of phlegm dampness results from abundant phlegm dampness or irregular food intake. Clinical manifestations are dizziness, suffocation, sensation in the chest, and nausea. The diagnosis is pale tongue copper with white and sticky coating and a soft and rolling pulse. For treatment, points Tao Wei, stomach 8, Mei Guan, pericardium 6, Zhong Wan, Ran 12, Feng Long, stomach 40, and Pi Shu, bladder 20, are needed for the even movement method to relax the chest, resolve phlegm, and eliminate dampness. After routine sterilization, puncture the Tao Wei, stomach 8 point, to treat dizziness. Pericardium 6 to relax the chest, harmonize the stomach, and check vomiting. Jin Wan, Ren 12 is needled to strengthen the spleen and stomach for eliminating dampness. Puncture Feng Long, stomach 40, with an even movement method to resolve the phlegm. And finally, Pi Shu, bladder 20, with an even movement method to nourish the spleen and eliminate dampness. The treatment should be given once daily or once every other day, and one course consists of 12 sessions. Headache. When headache is a predominant symptom, it's usually a result of the invasion of pathogenic wind into the meridians, hyperactivity of the liver yang, deficiency of both qi and blood, or stagnation of blood due to trauma. The elements such as hypertension, migraine, and nervous headache in modern medicine may be included. Headache caused by invasions of pathogenic winds into the meridians may occur suddenly. It is a violent stabbing pain. According to the location, it may be categorized into four types. Frontal headache, Temporal headache, occipital headache, and parietal headache. Frontal headache pertains to headaches of the Yangming meridians. For treatment, the points Tao Wei, stomach 8, Shangxing, Du 23, Yintang, extra point, Hegu, large intestine 4, and Meiting, stomach 44, are selected and treated with the reducing method to regulate the meridians. After routine sterilization, puncture local points Tao Wei, stomach 8, Shangxing, Du 23, 
and in time extra point. Distal points Hangu, large intestine four. And Nei Ting, stomach 44, are punctured to regulate the meridians and relieve the pain. Temporal headache pertains to the Xiaoyang meridian headache. For treatment, points Feng Shi, gallbladder 20, Shuai Gu, gallbladder 8, Tai Yang, extra point, Wai Guan, San Jiao 5, and Xia Xi, gallbladder 43, are all needled with a twirling and reducing method to remove obstructions in the Xiaoyang meridians. After routine sterilization, puncture the local points Feng Shi, gallbladder 20, Shuai Gu, gallbladder 8. And Tai Yang, extra point, to dispel the wind and regulate the meridian. Distal points Wai Guan San Jiao 5 and Xia Xi 43 are punctured to regulate the Qi in the Xiaoyang meridians. Occipital headache pertains to the Taiyang extra point meridian. For treatment, Points Hoding, Tianzhu, Bladder 10, and Kunlun, Bladder 60, are needled with a twirling and reducing method to regulate Qi in the Taiyang extra point meridians. After routine sterilization, local points Hoding, Du 19, and Tianzhu, letter 10, are needled to regulate the qi in the occipital region. Distal point Kunlun, letter 60, is needled to regulate qi in the Taiyang extra point meridians. Parietal headache pertains to Jueyin meridian headaches. For treatment, points Bai Hui, Du 20, Tongtian, Bladder 7, Taichong, Liver 3, and Jueyin, Bladder 67, are needled with the twirling and reducing methods to regulate Qi in the Jueyin meridians. After routine sterilization, Local points Bai Hui, Du 20, and Tongtian, letter 7, are needled with the reducing method to regulate Qi in the top area of the head. To regulate Qi in the Jiayin meridians, Needle distal points Taichung liver 3 and Juyin bladder 67. Headache due to hyperactivity of the liver is characterized by severe pains on both sides on the top of the head, blurred vision, irritability, and a hot temper. The red tongue proper is yellow coated is swing to us, and there is a rapid pulse. 
界聊，七百会，玄卢，风百会，霞西，玄卢，平间，玄卢，碾断线，八百，平干齐，方尺，八百二十，霞西，八百二十三 ，and 平间 ，liver two are all needled with a twirling and reducing method to pacify the liver young. 常规消毒后，进步真百会。After routine sterilization, puncture local points by Hui do twenty. 真玄炉，玄炉 ，Gallbladder five. 真风池，以舒适上力为主。To pacify the liver young。寻经元曲，霞溪。Puncture distal points， 霞溪。Gallbladder forty three。行间，以书写肝胆经体。To dispel qi in the liver and the gallbladder. 气血亏虚所致的疼痛，正是较缓。红肿、昏肿、神疲乏力、面色不佳、blurred vision、劳累、加重、a lusterless face and is aggravated by overstrain. The patient has a pale tongue with a thin and white coating, and there is a weak and thready pulse. For treatment, points Bai Hui do twenty, Qi Hai Ren six, Zhu Sanli stomach thirty six, Gan Shu bladder eighteen, Pi Shu bladder twenty, and Shen Shu bladder twenty three are needled with a twirling and reinforcing method. Accompanied by mild moxibustion to regulate and nourish qi in blood. After routine sterilization, puncture by Hui do twenty to raise the clear yang. Zhen Jiu Qi Hai Xue, to boost yang qi. Puncture Qi Hai Ren Six. And apply moxibustion to nourish the primary qi. Zhen Jiu Zhu San Li Xue, puncture Zhu San Li, stomach thirty-six, and apply moxibustion to nourish the spleen and stomach, and the qi and blood. 针灸肝腧。Puncture the points 肝腧 bladder eighteen。脾腧 bladder twenty。And Shen Shu, letter twenty-three. Apply moxibustion to strengthen the liver, spleen, and kidney. The treatment should be given once daily or once every other day. One course consists of twelve sessions. Facial pain. Facial pain is a kind of severe pain occurring in transient paroxysms in certain facial regions. It is mostly due to an invasion of pathogenic wounds or cold, or excessive fire in the liver and stomach, or a deficiency of yin and excess of fire. It is referred to as trigeminal neuralgia in modern medicine. Upper 
for jaw pain it is most commonly seen clinically. It is a severe and paroxysmal pain on the maxillary region, which is due to pain of the second branch of the trigeminal nerve. For treatment, the points Sibai, stomach 2, Quanliao, small intestine 18, Juliao, stomach 3, Wubu, large intestine 4, and Neiting, stomach 44, on the affected side, are needled with a twirling and reducing method to dispel the wind and cold and to remove obstructions in the yawning meridian. After routine sterilization, puncture the points Sibai, stomach 2, Zhen Jue Liao, stomach three. Zhen Jue Liao, small intestine eighteen, to dispel wind and bring down the fire. Zhen He Gu, Wei Xin Xin Yuan Fu, large intestine four, a distal point, to remove the obstructions in the Yangming meridian. Puncture Yiting, stomach 44, a distal point, to reduce the excessive fire. To strengthen the effect, electric needling is applied to Quanliao, small intestine 18, and Hegu, large intestine 4, with continuous waves and rapid frequency for 30 to 60 minutes. Supraorbital pain is a severe and paroxysmal pain of the first branch of the trigeminal nerve. For treatment, points Quanzhu, letter 2, Yang Bai, Gob letter 14, Yu Yao, extra point, He Gu, large intestine 4, and Neiting, stomach 44, of the affected side, are needled with a twirling and reducing method to dispel wind and heat. After routine sterilization, puncture Quanzhu, letter 2, Yang Bai, Gob Letter 14, Zhen Yu Yao, Yi Shu Xie, E Bu Jing Qi, and Yu Yao, Extra Point, to remove obstructions on the forehead area. Puncture Hegu, large intestine 4. Zhen stomach 44, in the same way as was done with upper jaw pain. With Quanzhu, letter 2, and He Gu, large intestine 4, electric needling is applied with continuous wave and rapid frequency for 30 to 60 minutes to enhance the effect. Lower jaw pain is a severe and paroxysmal pain of the mandibular nerve, the third branch of the trigeminal nerve. For treatment, points Xiaguan, stomach 7, Jiache, stomach 6, Jiachengjiang, extra point, Hegu, large intestine 4, and Neiting, stomach 44, on the affected side, are needled with a twirling and reducing method to dispel wind and heat and to regulate the meridian. After routine sterilization, puncture Xiaguan, stomach 7,
真夹车。假车 ，stomach six。And Jia Changjiang, extra point, to dispel the wind, heat, and regulate the meridians. Puncture Hegu, large intestine four. And kneading, stomach forty-four. In the same way as was done with upper jaw pain. To strengthen the effect, an electric needle is applied to the Xia Guan stomach seven and He Gu large intestine four points with continuous wave and rapid frequency for 30 to 60 minutes. The treatment is given once a day, one course consisting of 12 sessions.